What's up everybody, I'm Logan from Sleepopolis and I recently did a review of the new Floyd mattress, but I've also gotten a lot of questions about the very popular Floyd bed frame. So I wanna do a quick video on my experience setting up the bed frame and give you a step-by-step -step guide on how to do that. Now, first things first, the bed frame comes with outside support, inside support, cork pads, tensioning straps, and panels. There are no tools, screws, anything like that that are necessary for the construction of the bed frame, everything comes in the package. Now to start, you just lay out the panels where you want the bed to be in the room. Then you place the middle and end supports about 18 inches from the foot and head of the bed. And then you use the tension straps to tie these supports all together. And now the tension that you use is actually what's going to keep the bed frame together as opposed to using screws or nails or anything like that. Now you might think, uh, you know, does that mean it's not going to be held together very strongly or does that mean it's going to move, something like that? I actually found that it had very nice solid support. Now, if you do get the headboard, it's really easy to add that as well. You're just gonna slide that onto the head of the bed, pop the uh, headboard right in there and tighten the uh, screws that are already attached to the supports. I actually really like the Floyd bed frame. It's got a really nice low profile look to it and did a really nice job of supporting the mattress. So that's it for the setup of the Floyd bed frame. The instructions do also come when you purchase the bed frame and you can find them online if for whatever reason you've lost them. Now, if you wanna know more about the Floyd mattress, you can find that full review and much more on sleepopolis.com. Also be sure to follow us on social media so you don't miss any of our sleep news or giveaway announcements and head to Sleepopolis for all of your sleep needs.